Hi everyone, it's Saturday, January 9th, and I just spent my morning finishing a book, um, David and Goliath by Malcolm Gladwell. He's one of my favorite authors. Um, wrote the outliers and tons of books that just like motivate you. They're like kind of self-help books, but they also give you background. It's basically telling you how other people have been successful or other people have overcome obstacles and it's super empowering. Um, so I'd recommend that anybody read this book. Um, there are tons of other books and I'm so excited to start some other personal development books of my own. Um, just like starting my day like this, like I've been, I've been reading every single morning um, and sometimes before bed at night too, I'll like walk around the basement or go on our stationary bike and read. And it's just a great way to like clear your mind and get your head in the right mindset to um, succeed and just be more positive in life. Um, and it's just, it's just amazing, amazing uh, what reading personal development books can do for you. Um, and like as a child, I really didn't like reading. I read a lot, but more, um, I was more motivated to just say I finished a book kind of thing and I wouldn't like comprehend what I was reading or get into it. But these I get into so, so, so much. Um, and they just like, you can apply them to your own life. And I've been like, as I read, I'm like, oh my gosh, mom, listen to this. Like, um, I need to tell you this story and like, listen to how empowering this is and hoping to kind of like spread that empowerment on other people. Um, and that's kind of like what I do as a coach, but it's kind of just my personality. So that's why coaching is so awesome for me. Um, and awesome for anyone, but, um, yeah. So I just wanted to share with you that little, the little, uh, how I start my day kind of thing. And, um, hopefully you find this helpful in, um, getting your day started right as well. All right. Have a great weekend, everyone. All right. See you later.